Let me see if it's that right here. Nice. Girl, who is you playing with? Just back that ass up. I don't give a fuck if you want love. I just want the ass. Just want the ass. I'm gonna tell the hooker one time. I need snacks up in this bitch. Hey, I done found out my new my new uh, phrase. If it ain't uh, if it ain't savage, it's average. Now I'm gonna start calling people a shit swizzler. I think that works. I like it. I just you want to just buy a loaf of bread, just make bread sandwiches all day. That shit, I'm getting a burrito. $200 Wait, what for fuck? a burrito? What? I'll take the chicken tendies. Uh, somehow, I have accrued dirty money. Uh, did you search someone that had some dirty money? I don't know. When you search people, you do realize that you're confiscating their, their belongings. This shit becomes well, really shit, Johnny. Right. I wouldn't have shut down my business. I could have laundered it, but, you know. Mm. Let me get some of this sprunk. Oh, we got a wanted call. And some, and some burritos. Where the fuck's the burrito? 602 to dispatch. Show me responding code 2 to that 911 call just outside the prison. Yeah, more 602. Tell you what, that should you. be an interesting call. My big fat toe. 602 dispatch, um, some additional information. I believe that might possibly be Miss Lynn, um, just released from um, State's Pleasure. Johnny, you can keep that small fish. Yeah, for it. Thank you. I tell you what I really want, though. You mean what you really, really want? A hood rat chick. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, 907 to 602. Send up. Uh, last known was the uh, 714 block, Joshua Road. Fuck you! Um, right, I want more chicken tendies. Not ready to go. What's going on? Trust me, I got this one. How you doing? Thanks for getting that clip there, Chuff. You gotta get in. Johnny, they have pineapples. You just have to accept it and move on. But I want Pineapple Express. You ain't get... Oh, actually, I would love some Pineapple I Express. Right pineapple now. three days fucking old. Alright. Well, Johnny, we found out a lot of information about uh, drugs. Dirty weapons, stuff like that. So let's see if we can find some people uh, perusing the area. Honestly, I think is it the server's running like shit right now because everyone's trying to get in. I bet that could be one reason we have lag is people might be trying to spam the server to get in. So it might actually turn out that this is not helping anyone. Should be attempting to respond to that last Frank one more to come. Ten four. Six eight two dispatch. Um, show everything code four here. Um, no sign of the suspect this time. Ten four six zero. Nine zero seven. So yeah, we're heading off. Thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, Have yourself a great night. You know. Towards uh, Bay Tree Canyon Road. I really wish they'd tell us what the fuck we're responding to, so 
Well, we kind of know. So we don't look like jackasses. Nope, kinda Johnny. Like Johnny, it's up to us to figure it out. We're the cops. The locals? They're just a bunch of idiots who needed us for help. He says as he smashes through shit. Yep. Are real right now. Uh, still heading west, uh, 653 block uh, Mario Avenue. How far? Johnny, you're gonna have to help me find this chicken. This is this is fat. Show me um, moving yeah. in that Take direction right. as well. Now go straight on this road. Keep going straight down this road. All ass. I think what I lost. Keep going straight. Yeah, keep going straight. Uh, 101. Uh, yeah, keep going straight. Nope. Seems to have uh, stolen another car. And straight to where you're going. Right, take right, take right. Go straight. Come on. All right, now heading south. 64. Block. Take your next left, and then take a right. It's gonna fork. Take a left and a right. This is 101 plus one. We are in range on our, uh, on our GPS. Keep going okay, straight. Fork. This time it's falling ass. Keep going straight. Still something fast and fine, but I think we're dealing with someone who started in Sandy. They've been upgrading their vehicle. Just moving along. Take a right. Oh, you car. Alright, he's apparently up on the house to our left, right here. Yeah, they're right here. Stop the vehicle, 101. We have a possible 1080. Yeah, we have a red Inferno, uh, 1080. Uh, Johnny called up for me. We're on 8 Jones Drive. I think we're heading west. Uh, 10-4, I see you guys. Uh, 6 at 5 block. Six eight two is, um... Coming on to crop, um, on the north North Rockford Drive. Where are you guys? On North Rockford Drive. Speed Vehicle's 1050, it's still going. It's We're heading right now. We're heading east Sorry. on uh, Marathon Avenue, just past behind my mama. Going back south on Bay City Avenue. I'll be attempting a pit maneuver. Hey, just turn around, going back north on uh, Bay City Avenue. Anyone would have just gotten into an accident there. We need to call local EMS. I don't want to dispatch. Please call local EMS. We've had an accident. Six eight two, still in pursuit. We're heading northwest on Great Ocean Highway. See, this is why we needed the fucking uh, Viper man. We couldn't give up with his ass. 
And you, you gotta be careful when initiating, uh, you know, a, a police interaction unmarked. They could shoot you and be fully within their rights. No, I mean, just for a pursuit vehicle, just a bit of it, yeah. Can't do that. No, oh, what the fuck that happened here? In excess of 120 miles Requesting that someone get here one in the sky ASAP, please. Oh, keep going, keep going. Will you yeah, board, we are in route with a spotter and a gunner. One on one, I have eyes on you again, taking second date. We're back on Gray Ocean Highway. Uh, 602 is going to pull to the side, let you guys go in front. 101 taking front. 602 secondary. Ah, uh, we're still on Great Ocean Highway heading north. We've been going to the tunnel. I think I'm just playing a game of let's, let's dodge the locals. And I'm at the disadvantage because sirens make everyone We're act like fucking the, idiots. Uh, the army base. Going for the pit as soon as they can, Johnny. Still on Great, great Ocean Highway. Here goes 1050. Box him in, box him in. Get out of the fucking vehicle! Out of the vehicle now! Get out of the fucking car! Miss hands up! I want your right hands now. up right now! All right, here's what you're going to do. You're going to keep those hands up, and you're going to get out the passenger side of the vehicle. All right. Miss Lynn, you are so fucked. Crap! I think you know your rights by now. Hell, at this point, you probably fucking know them better than I do. Actually, hold on a second. Uh, before I search you, do you have anything on you that I should know about? Any uh, any needles or anything? Uh, Legos. Legos. All right, Johnny, can you give me some space so I can just check her out real quick? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna move this. Uh, 90701, are you guys uh, 1028 up there? Or, uh, disregard. Uh... Johnny, go ahead and call uh, Pee Wee to. 101 to 403. Go ahead and call Pee Wee. I'll stay, I'll stay here with them um, for cleanup, sir. All right, thank you very much. That was excellent backup. I fucked up. You nailed it. You got right on them. Wouldn't have got it without you. Thanks a bunch, man. Great work. No problem, sir. Just remember that when you're um, looking at promotion, sir. Ah, indeed. Indeed. All right, Miss Lynn, please watch your head. This is 101. Uh, we are code four, suspect in custody. Uh, 10 four. Miss Lynn, Miss Lynn, when will you finally learn? You know what? You know what? Hold on a second. You know what, Johnny? I think there's yeah, something Miss Lynn way. needs to say. I think there's something Miss Lynn needs to see. Please keep your taser out in case she tries to do anything, or if she's horrified. But she needs to see this. She needs to see what she did. All right, Miss Lynn, we're gonna go, go ahead and get you out there. I'm not gonna the light if she tries to run. Now go ahead and step off the vehicle, Mets. Yeah, please, if you can. Thank you. All right. 
Missler. Tell me something. I mean, maybe, maybe, maybe you can't see it. But do you, do, do you happen to see what's all over the hood of my car? Uh, no, sir. All right. Well, let me tell you what's there. Johnny, you see what's there? Well, it's in raspberries and fucking blood. That is a shitload of blood all over the hood of my car. Why do you think that blood is there? You ran over locals? Because three local civilians were struck and possibly killed while officers were in pursuit of a car thief. It's all fun and games until an entire fucking family gets killed. Um, sir? That code five is at um, the Merriweather base. Are we just gonna Truth. let them UTL? Because I'm not sure we've got the numbers to, to do anything with it right now. Um, if something happens down there, not much we can do unless we have all hands on deck. Uh, try and Four find something on radio if we can. Responding code to you to uh, Merriweather area for the medical call. 101. 101 402. Uh, I, I request at least two additional units go with you, please. That's one hell of an area. Uh, we have they, three. We will shoot on site. 10 4. Hey, KC3, thank you very much for the 100 biddies. I really Sir, appreciate you need to it. to drive that motorcycle. Not much part of a biker if you can't ride a motorcycle. All right, officer. Thanks again. Uh, radio in when the car's uh, code four. Uh, ten four, sir. That was that was an awesome chase. That was, that was a lot of fun. So what do you think, Johnny? Involuntary manslaughter times three. Well, that's if they don't make it. I'll say this, at least it wasn't beard slaughter. If I got any of that blood in my beard, oh, <laughs> there is no punishment in our books. You could, you could possibly do justice. Blood on the hood of my car? What do you think happened to the last guy that got in my way? Jeez. All of the lights. I mean, let's be honest. It's not like... Oh, that was Pee Wee. 101, uh, 602. Looks like Pee Wee is on the... Yeah, just drove by. Well, I mean, the word the word bitch isn't that bad to use in front of a lady as long as you're not like rudely calling her a bitch unless she deserved it. Um, but you know, this, the the sea bomb that's the one that you don't say in front of the ladies. Uh, yeah, that's, well, that's the mean, one. Yeah. This ain't no lady in the back seat. I'm just throwing that out there. A, a lady does not, you know, steal a vehicle. Oh, no, no. Plenty of ladies steal vehicles. Um, but it's just, you know, what I want to know is now that she's seen what can truly happen as a result of her actions, I want to know what choices she'll make from here. Anyone can come to a city and fuck shit up. But it's, you know, when, when things like this happen, that's when you find out what kind of person you're. She's not the female driver to city walks. 
but the one in the city needs. Uh, dispatch all units, safety check. 101 plus 6, uh, 403, we are, uh, code 4. 4. 6 I 2. I'm kind of lost. 6 I 2 is, uh... 401, 402, 102, all clear from that call in Mayweather. 10 4. Uh, hey, this fucking another noise emergency, sounds familiar. Uh, emergency is that call in I didn't, haven't found it. I don't know what you're talking about, Johnny. Oh, you fucking lie. I no, I I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about, and you don't know what you're talking about either. And that's the way it is. No, I mean, but I mean, like, don't get me wrong. You're right, but you, I don't know what you're talking about, and you don't know what you're talking about, and that's the way it is. Ten four. C bomb definitely equals cap. Sorry, what, Johnny? Nothing. Shit wow. Some people just have no respect for the code twos up in this bitch. I'm oh, sorry, up in this female doge. Hey, what y'all do? They're walking their fat asses around PD, you know? They're hoping to pick up a man with a pension. They heard we all got raises. I'll give him something that starts with a P, but it ain't gonna be a pension. Are you talking about a promotion? I, I, think, I, think, I think it would be in your best interest if it was a promotion and you just left it at that. Alright, Miss Lynn, we'll be taking you out. Please watch your head. All right, Miss Lynn, and uh, if you'll come right this way, is it's much easier to uh, to not drag you through these doors. One on one dispatch. Do we have any EMS or cops who can take that last call? Six I two still waiting for um this vehicle to be um picked up, but I can. Ignore us and divert that if need be. Uh, this is 907. Uh, I can head over there if need be. Uh, yeah, 10-4 is wood. I like the high heels. Uh, Where'd you get them from? I think I might get two. It's pretty. Uh, 10-4. Uh, on the way. Well. This is 101. Show me going 10-6 to deal with, uh, subject in custody. Sound muted. Sound muted. What? Johnny, can you hear me? Yeah. All right, here's the deal. You see, you see the, the tabs in this notebook? I just alternated the tabs to, as a joke. I thought it'd be funny. Now I can't see shit. Uh, I think someone put I think someone put pepper spray in here and I touched my eyes. Oh wait, no, I can see. All right, I got the pepper out of my eyes. It's it's a miracle. I can see. <clears throat> All right, well, Miss Lynn, you certainly have been exercising that right to remain silent. Um, as I said, we are going to be pursuing charges of involuntary manslaughter. Um, would you like uh, Would you like an attorney for this? Um. Since they don't have uh, no. Well, I can I can put an advertisement out and see if there's anyone willing to take your case pro bono. I'll take it if you give me the heels. I'm not talking about that. <laughs> That's not the kind of pro bono we're talking about, Johnny. Oh, oh, my bad. All right, uh, let me put a call out for a lawyer. If we can get a response in the next five minutes, maybe we can have something for you. Um, other than that, just uh, hang tight. Trying to give me some space real uh, quick. Oh, will do, sir. Okay, hang on. Let me pull my cigarette out. Okay, now I got it.
Oh, uh, Miss Lynn, could you come on over here and let me grab your license, please? Which pocket will I find that in? Uh, left pocket. It's not a police option. Alright, right right, Miss Lynn, I, uh, you know, I'll be honest. Uh, I, had a, I, I did a lot of work last week, you know? Fucking chasing shitbirds left and right, paperwork... A mile high, uh, getting getting things ready, this and that. And uh, this weekend, you know what I said to myself? I said, uh, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to play some Pokemon Go. I fucking deserve it. So let's see, Miss Lynn. What kind, of, what kind of trouble were you up to while I was out at a, are you ready for this? A fucking Machop ma nest. That's what I'm talking about. 300 fucking Machop candy. Bam! What you think about that? Yeah, speechless. Machop candy? Like, how does someone get 300 in one night? Psh, pineapps? Double candy? This event is crazy. I'll tell you, instead of getting into stolen cars, maybe you should uh, go play Pokemon Go instead. Or you can give me them high things. that's something I could do. Yeah, of course you can. I mean, like, look at the town hall. You can go spin over there, get some fucking Pokeball. You know, I saw, not not that this matters, but I, oh, whoops, not that this matters, but I saw a Jinx at town hall the other day. So, I mean, if you don't have one of those, then go for it. But, I mean, you know, I, I have a bunch of those. I mean, like, you know, Jinx, Jinx, <laughs> Jinx ain't no thing. All right, let's actually get there. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Johnny, are you ready for one hell of a story? Uh, why not? If I ain't, I'll always wish I was. I, I call this story, I call this story, uh, I don't know, I was going to try and come up with something clever, but I didn't come up with it in five seconds, so now it's awkward. What does it have to do with? Uh, how about, uh, how about Miss Aubrey Lynn in the City of Sin? That'll be the name of this story I'm gonna read. <clears throat> Once upon a time, there was an accepted fine. It was for $1,300 in unpaid medical bills. And then, uh, it wasn't but just a few hours later that yours truly, Sheriff Ralph Cass, discovered that our woman, Miss Aubrey Lynn, was in possession of a stolen vehicle. Well, our hero in this story felt, uh, you know, he understands that when you come to the city and things are new and you don't really know what's what, yeah, sometimes it's easy just to pull someone out of their car, punch them in the face and drive away with it and flip them the bird. You know, I've been there. Everyone's been there. Uh, so I went easy. You know, could have gone 3000 Went $1,000 instead. The day carried on. Our sheriff, he patrolled. He, uh, he kept the city safe. Well, our, uh, well, I wouldn't say villain is the right word, but our cheeky fucker. Well, she was stalking the streets in search of another vehicle to steal. And of course that went exactly as you'd expect, Johnny. Bam! Gotcha. With the help of uh, four two Detective Justice himself, with uh, with what I've been told, he maneuvered a pit that just wouldn't quit. And uh, we 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 gave her no breaks. She was issued a three thousand dollar fine for uh, that GTA. Oh yeah, and did I mention that she also served fifteen months of felony? Evasion. That's French for evasion. And that's fine. That's fine, right? I mean, what does it matter, right? Because two days later, Deputy Chief Crosa discovered you in a stolen vehicle. I could continue to read this story. 
or I could flip a couple of pages and get to the part where she thought she was clever. She stole a series of cars. I'm sure each one faster than the next. Until she found her perfect little point where she could look out onto the beautiful county of Los Santos and wonder what she was going to take next. But Johnny, what she didn't know is that what she was going to take next was responsibility for three lost souls in this beautiful city. Does that story sound about right, Miss Lynn? Hi, yeah. Mm, indeed. Like I said, Miss Lynn, I understand. It's easy to show up somewhere and cause a bunch of fucking trouble. I get it. It's nice and easy. Sometimes it's profitable. Hell, one could say it's even a good time. But what you do next, now that you've seen the consequences of these actions, this is what you'll be judged by. This is, this is where you will show me and everyone else in this city what kind of person we're dealing with. Criminal mastermind, shit fucker upper, or someone who uh, maybe made a few mistakes and changed their ways. There's no shortage of them around here. You wouldn't be alone. I mean, look at Johnny. You can tell by the way he composes himself. He's uh, <clears throat> definitely made a few mistakes in his life. Yeah, I'm a boss ass bitch. He's a boss ass bitch. We call him Babs for short. All right, uh, Johnny, can you give me some space? I need to uh, go over the, the final charges here. Yeah, I can put my safe right after. I'm just gonna get on the wall and smoke. You can keep that clipboard, that one's yours. All right, Miss Lynn, here's what we're looking at. Stolen vehicle. Uh, I mean, we know times one, but I think we can all assume times three. I'm pretty sure you, uh, <laughs> you fucking, you did some advanced hitchhiking on your way home from prison. And, you know, our GPSs can, can track the local calls all the way back. Uh, stolen vehicle times three. You know, I could get you for nine fucking grand on that if I really wanted to. And, you know, who would tell me no? I'm the fucking sheriff, right? I'd say you fucking did it. They'd say, what if she didn't? I'd hit him with my clipboard, and I'd tell him to fuck off. But what I'm going to do is I'm only going to give you the $3,000 fine for one stolen vehicle, even though it was one hell of a vehicle. Uh, 1080, high-speed pursuit, felony evasion, if you want to get official about it. Uh, as you've already found out the hard way, this is a 15-month sentence. Uh, and we're also looking at... Uh, well, you know, I have to get the official word from the locals. Um, if these guys didn't make it, you know, before I can finalize these charges, I have to call the hospital. But uh, if they didn't make it, you're looking at potential manslaughter, of, of, of z involuntary manslaughter of anywhere from one to three people. You know, I know it was my car that hit them, but why, why would my car have been driving 120 through an area like that? You know, it wasn't like I just said, fuck this shit, I'm going on the sidewalk. Uh, a local, I mean, they had the green light, I had the red. A local went through their green light, and uh, they they made me swerve off. It was either smash into them at full speed, or take my chances on the sidewalk. I mean, that sounds silly when you put it like that, but still. Take my chances, trying to hit nothing instead of definitely hitting something. And... Uh, All right, Johnny, uh, keep an eye on her for a few. I'm going to go upstairs and call the hospital. I'll find out what happened to them. What's going on, Caffeine Terry? Lord Taco Gamer, how you doing? Oh, Caffeine Terry, you going to bed? All right, well, I missed you. Have yourself a good one, man. This has been some some solid fucking roleplay here, though. Cat versus mouse dropped a thousand bits. 
over like five minutes ago. Cat vs. Mouse, thank you for the, the thousand bits. Much appreciate. I, I know how I'm going to play this out. I know what I'm going to tailor downstairs. I'm muted on the radio, that's right. Sound resumed. Oh, it happened again. Something about alt tabbing is very painful right now. I might need to close my game and reopen it. One oh one dispatch. Go ahead. Do we happen to know if the uh, the locals ever reported back about the three people that were struck during that 1080? Yeah, you know, it was three local civilians that were struck by my car in an accident. I have not heard anything. Tenfold, I think. <laughs> not, not that you, you know, should have heard anything, but yeah. Hey! They escaped. You sure about that? Yeah, I was just saying if you give me like a what the fuck kind of reaction. Um, I I was probably going to hold you responsible. Probably. First thing I wanted to do, honestly, though, was make sure she didn't log out. I didn't do it. All right. Well, uh, I, I, I know you didn't do it. I didn't do nothing. All right. Well, here's what's going to happen. Uh, if, the, if those people were killed, um, I'm sure we would have heard about it by now. I mean, I know the locals have never told us if anyone died before, but I mean, I feel like I feel like this is the time they would have. So we're going to let her off on the manslaughter. I think she understands what she did. She knows she's proper fucked. And, uh, I, th I here's what I'm thinking, Johnny. Um, I think it's in her best interest to call a fucking Uber when she gets out of jail in 15 months. Yeah, we're gonna have to chase her again. Mm, ten four on that. Well, she better realize, at this point, I don't care what the fucking fine says. If I catch her stealing a vehicle to ride home from the fucking prison, she's going to jail again. For fucking 15 months, I don't give a shit. She's going to learn her lesson one way or the other. All right, Miss Lynn, I just got off the phone with the hospital. And, uh, you know, there was no news on these people, and for you, I'm gonna say right now, no news is good news. Because let me tell you, if we had three bodies on our hands, fucking EMS would be out there right now rioting. Um, so, uh, you know, you're lucky this time. We are gonna be sending you to jail for 15 months. You know the rules of prison. Keep your fucking hands to yourself. Don't touch nothing, and the guards won't shoot you. And, uh, now here's the deal. Here's the deal. Uh, you're stealing vehicles left and right, and normally a jail sentence is not associated with a stolen vehicle. But, uh, based on the actions that have led up to this point, if you were caught in a stolen vehicle on your way home from fucking prison, so help me God, you will lose your license for 48 hours, and you will immediately go back to jail for 15 months. Is that understood, Miss Lynn? There's a taxi service. They would be happy to help you. And who knows? Maybe even they could give you a line on a good job that someone like you could finally start to make up for all the fucking shit they caused. I'll definitely ask them, sir. Alright, Miss Lynn. I hope for both our sakes. This is the last time we have this conversation. Johnny, if you could give me a little bit of room, I'm gonna sign her paperwork and I'm gonna have her sent off. Do take care of yourself over there. I 
I fucked up. I meant to do something else first. That's fine. All right, there, she's fine. She's gone. You got it. All right, bus came for her. Excellent. All right, I didn't properly do the ticket RP. Other than that, I was pretty happy with that whole thing. Uh, let's see. All right, well, that was pretty good. I was, I mean, I know, like, people might think I was really mad at her, but that was, that was great. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. That was good fucking role play. Uh, it was a great car chase. And, uh, you know. Uh, that dispatch, show me responding code to, to that last medical call. Uh, Johnny Robbins, go ahead and get back on the on the radio, and uh, we're going to go hit the streets. 10 4. 101 dispatch. Uh, go ahead, 101. Please be advised, um,. Miss Miss Aubrey Lynn has been told that regardless of the fact that it is a $3,000 fine, if she is caught stealing a vehicle on her way home from prison, she is to immediately go back to jail for 15 months and her license is to be revoked for 48 hours. 10-4. Uh, 102, uh, 101. Go ahead, 102. Uh, man, uh, she was advised that exact same thing by me yesterday. Did she steal a vehicle to get home from prison yesterday? Uh, no, but she stole two other vehicles around town. It's a step in the right direction. Damn her. <laughs> Is he chewing some tobacco or something? Also, dispatch, be advised. I think uh, Johnny Robbins is taking a spirit 